What does it mean? I know what it means. Yeah. If you're if you're in pain and, and hurting and I'm in pain and hurting, <laughs> it means we should soothe each other. <laughs> soothe each other. Yeah. What the hell? Right? We should I lay mean, hands. Then you get it that this is where he's coming. <laughs> what the hell? We should we should soothe each you, other. So then you get hurts. this man coming. Yeah, I saw that I one saw coming. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't yeah. it clear? One and one plus two. Oh, one and one plus two. One and one equals two. You don't have to ask what does it mean. Oh, <laughs> wow. Oh, look at this. Uh, this guy is going to use. Uh, this guy wants to use my my uh, picture of my front yard in a video game, a video game card. Huh. Really? Yeah. It's oh. it's about science and. Um, and education. He's a teacher. Oh. And he's making a, a card game about talking about uh, about animals and places in California and stuff. Sounds real educational, okay. real, real positive. Yeah. Not one of these, you know, demonic, evil ones, but this one's about nature and nature. about learning uh, stuff. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. Wholesome, wholesome about stuff. life. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Says he can't pay me, but he's gonna send me a card and he's gonna give me credit. Oh, I had to tell him uh, to put my YouTube channel on there, too. So, what's going on? Why have you been sick? I've been, been sick. I've been praying. Oh, so I thought you were sick. I've been praying and fasting. Yeah. yeah. Great fasting, you know, not eating nothing at all. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and it's so, I mean, come over here to see me start through the water now, and I'm like, I have to, like, wow. What water? Not water, I mean the plants. See, oh. I can't even talk straight. We got yeah, some here. We gotta eat food, you know? To be strong. So, I mean, I went into another world and here. They didn't want to talk to nobody here. I wanted to talk to Father. Yeah. Father, to get answers for help. That's what I've been doing. What do you need help with? You know what I've been talking to you about? Oh, I'll talk to you about oh, Veronica? <laughs> Where'd you come up with that name? <laughs> I don't come up with names. I don't come up with names. Well, it had to come to you, you la, somehow. La, father, tell me everything. Okay, so, okay. If I, if I say to you, I get, I got that, that's what I, that's where I get it from. And I say that, and I don't say it in joke. This is not funny to me. That's pretty serious. I laugh in the face of danger. Yes, you laugh in the face of danger. <laughs> All right, Lion King. Yes. Huh? Yeah, All right, Lion King. <laughs> oh, that what, I never saw that movie. Is that what he you says? You never saw Lion King? Yeah, Lion King. I never King. saw it. Wow. Oh, so. Is that what he says? That's what he said. Well, that's true. When I was in the fight, I walk on the wild side. I laugh in the face of danger. Ha, 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 ha. When I was in the cage fighting that giant. I laughed. Mm -hmm. Wow. <laughs> yeah. That guy was so big. He was mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. six, but eight, four hundred and twenty-five pounds. Big and wow. <laughs> that is oh funny. Fighting his That's eighth big. fight, and my left arm did not work. What? Yeah, you know, I went to fight a giant with one arm tied behind my back, and I laughed. <laughs> And the first thing, he punched me in the face. Boom, but I kept going. I knocked him down. Wow. Did pretty good. What he won. Wow. But so I'm, what now I'm listed as a professional it? cage fighter. <laughs> and they paid me 500 bucks. And it made me so that uh, someone could they say, Oh, I can, you. oh yeah, you're a crybaby. You cry over a, a rainbow. You're a sissy. But yeah, I can get into a giant with the right. cage. You know, with the, with the cage. <laughs> yeah, right? I can do it all. Anything. <laughs> <laughs> All right? That gives me the credibility to not be a sissy. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But first, what do you want us? You was talking about the list. What you oh, I. Do you see all the trees I cut down and all the work I did? Mm -hmm. Man. So that guy came and helped. <sighs> that guy came and helped me a lot. Uh, 
So there's just a few. There's just a few more trees that I got to get. We couldn't get all. We got. To, we were too tired. But uh, once I get there's like one clump of trees down here, and there's one clump of trees that are like. You mean just, trees? Actual big trees, like what he was. They're not. Down? No, not that big. They're they're halfway between brushes and trees. Okay. Yeah, I I just need to. Mostly, what I need is someone there. If 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 someone's there. Then if, you know... Because we don't have no, none of us here have any kind of expertise with... No, it doesn't, you don't need to have that, any... Like, you don't need to have like any skills to do this. I just need someone there. Need no trees knocking down on us. Yeah, I just need someone there watching me. You know, it's like there might be something behind my back that, you know, that I don't see or something could be falling on me. You know what I mean? Okay. It's just much safer with two people. I mean, if something happens to me... And I get hurt, then someone can see, oh, yeah, he got hurt, run and get help, or run and help me, or, okay. you know what I mean? Because it's a dangerous thing uh, to do that. Tell me about it. Yeah, but it's, it's dangerous. much less dangerous if you have someone there with you, you know what I mean? Right. So, so if it, you know, if I'm out there by, my cha by myself with a chainsaw, and, you know, and something falls on me, and I, I you know, maybe it knocks me out or something, who's going to know, you know? I could be there for hours. You know what I mean? He'll be there for hours. Huh? Yeah, he'll be there. Dangerous stuff, man. Well, but life is dangerous, you know, and if you take all the precautions you can, you can't not do stuff because it's da dangerous. You have to do all the precautions, take all the precautions you can. And then still do live your life, you know, like I'm trying to get the solar here, you know, it's just like, I got to take out these trees. You saw how much we did, man. We did a lot. That's why my back hurts, because I worked two days just uh, working on that stuff. But anyhow, um, so I'm wanting to finish that done, finish that. Uh, probably, I think I could do it in two hours, but probably only one hour at a time because it's real hard. It's real hard work. I got to carry that saw. Saw it. You have to. You have to pull the brush and all that. It's real labor intensive. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I only want to do like an hour at a time. But uh, that's what I want to get done. Then I need to make sure there's water up there. If you just put all the stuff up there and make sure that there's water flowing. I can snap it together. Okay, so that's what we were talking about. Yeah, that's what, what we were exactly wondering. Exactly. We want to exactly. know what you hold, you know. Because now you got the tank up there, but if yeah. you don't want to mess with the tank, we'll just... Run Not right now. I just want to make sure that the wa the water comes off of this corner yeah. and goes up the hill. All right. And that uh, you can turn it off and on from this corner. All right. That's that's all I, all I need. And then all the stuff, all the parts and stuff, uh -huh. if you put it up there, I'll put it together. I don't care. You know what I mean? I just like need to know where you put all the stuff, or make sure it's up there, or something like mm -hmm. that. You know, it, I mean, once you got everything in place, it only takes a few minutes to snap right. it all together, and not and and that if I have water. Yeah. So, because I got to get those plants up there. Did you see? Are they okay? They're on the they're on the carts. Do they look like they're they're okay? Or I thought I haven't gone up to them today. I haven't uh, been straight up, you know, like looked at them close. Yeah. But I can. They they might need water. I but, think they need water. Yeah. Because they might not be too here. Everything dry <coughs> quick. Yeah. I know. They probably need water. I know. Get up and then it's hill. so hard to get back once. Get I, I don't. I don't have a good crop going this year, and it's already. It's already really late. But what about them seeds? You say I put them in the. They all sprout. Or got a lot they of sprouts. Sprout. I put. I put all those ones that were right there, and then all the ones that were in there. I put them in there, and they all have sprouts in them. Okay. So, and we and I watered them yesterday. So. The best I could do. I don't know if it's going to work or not. I might not have a crop this year, or if I do, it might be just a real little one. What about the guy that you said was going to come? Flake. He's not coming. I don't know. I I, I told him he was supposed to be here by June first. If he's if you know, if he didn't call me today and say I'm on my way, then I'm going to say it's too late. Some of these people, you don't never know, you know, like they contact you and they say all kinds of things, right. oh, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And they're just flakes, like you know grand, what I mean? I even have grand, people like come talk, here, I had these two girls come here one time and they were like, I was like, I need help working on this greenhouse, you know, and they're like, oh yeah, we're going to stay a month, we'll build two greenhouses, you know, and they came here and they, they, 
they were, first of all, they were all drugged out from going to New Year's on San Francisco. Mm -hmm. And then they slept the first day, and the next day, oh, we want to go to Yosemite real bad. They had a car, you know, so mm -hmm. I'm like, okay, I'll go with you. And then the next day, we worked for like two hours, and like, oh, we're tired. And the next day, they left when I went to the market. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? They left me 50 bucks. Yeah. And that was when I was real poor. Yeah. So 50 bucks to me back then was a lot. Tell me about yeah. it. Yeah. And they worked, the little part, bit they worked here, we were working all around here, they're cleaning my yard and everything, and my friend comes up and he's like, how do you get two pretty girls to clean your house? <laughs> yeah, right. So I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> and then they left me $50 too, so I couldn't you be too mad at them. Hey, you still have two pretty girls to go on? Did you, did you call a friend and tell them that? Yeah, no, he, was not, he just came. But, uh, but, oh, but the next day after they left, the, mm. the double rainbow came. Mm. Ah. They needed to be gone they because I needed to be here by myself when that mm -hmm. happened. Yeah. It wouldn't have happened Before if you. they were here. Mm -hmm. Or it wouldn't it have been the same. The same thing. It yeah. would have the same effect. Yeah. They would be disturbed. And then so like, you know, I was like mad at them and they're like, you know, I was like, whatever, you know, go away. And then after I became famous, they wanted to be my friend again. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, yeah, right. You didn't forgive them? Well, I mean, it's like, it's, you know, I, it's not like I, there was really anything to forgive. They, they, you know, they did more. I would say they fulfilled their contract, but they made up for it with the 50 bucks, which I really needed. Mm -hmm. uh, but, uh, but, you know, I'm not going to be their I friend, you know, you. I'm not going to. I'm just messing with you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, I'm not going to say, oh, it was all great and everything after you did yeah, me like that. Right. Do me that again. Come on. Do it again. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know, they, now because I was all famous, they wanted to be associated with me, you know, it's like, mm. yeah, right. Yeah. They made their... Did they really... Are you really serious? They really write you? They, they contact oh, you? Oh, yeah. Afterwards, again? they wanted to... They wanted... They put my picture with them on their on the front page of their of their their Ooh. profile yeah. and everything. Yeah, oh. it was like a big deal. Yeah. We, we were with the rainbow man. <laughs> <laughs> It's okay, so, okay, I just want to get this straight just so that we get this straight. All right. Um, the, your priority is the water stuff. So that yeah, we get that water somebody. stuff right there. Yeah. And then I just need someone to help me when I, when I do the chainsaw stuff. And, you know, I can't do very much of it at a time. Okay. You know what I mean? I just need someone there with me okay. who can, who can uh, watch me and help me pull brush away. Because I'm cutting... You know, I don't want them to get anywhere near the chainsaw. Okay. I just want them to, like, grab a thing and pull it away. You can still be 10 feet away, okay. you know. And uh, I've been doing this for a long time. I work for the California Conservation Corps. I work, I work for LA County Fire Department. I work for the Forestry Crew in Yosemite for the National Park Service. I have many years of chainsaw work. I know how to be safe, you know. I never had any accidents or anything like that. You know, I, just, I know when, when it's not safe and I know when it is safe. And I'm not going to put anyone in harm's way. You know what I mean? That's why I'm asking for help, because I don't want to put myself in harm's way. So. Okay, I'm just uh, kind of leery about any, because you know what I do with that stuff? I'm, when I have my house and yard, I call somebody to cut that stuff, and I'm far away in the house. <laughs> yeah, but... You know what I mean? Yeah, that's but see, who you would call would be me. <laughs> <laughs> or at least when I was young, you know. Yeah. Like the, the wood guy, the tree guy. Yeah, know, that used to people. be me. The tree people. I, I worked in the forestry crew in Yosemite. Okay. You know? Okay. Well, I know what I'm well, doing. And it's like I'm not going to put anyone in any kind of... In any we kind of danger or harm's way. We just don't want to cut no tree. Cut no, no tree. None of this is it's worth anyone getting hurt. No, None of it not. is worth anyone getting hurt. Mm -hmm. So that's that's how I feel, and you know my main thing is like I'm all about safety first. You know I don't want no one. That's why I, that's why whenever we go somewhere like we went to go and cut those things, I want you to put on your boots that I gave you. You know what I mean? It's like that that's that you're just asking for trouble there. You know when you, we 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 work, you got to have your boots on. You know what I mean? Because your feet are real. They're real tender, you know what I mean? And those boots, they protect you. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, you know, you're free to walk around however you want, but when we work and we're around tools and 
you know, you're hit, doing the shovel and we're on the truck and all that. You gotta have boots on. And that was my fault for not paying attention when we left. You know, when we were out there, I was like, yeah. But I, you know, I couldn't say nothing. We were already gone. I need to get. Oh, uh, next time you go into town, I want to see if you can take the my cans and the plastic. You said they take it for free because my truck's not running. I can't go to the dump. The truck's not working. Mm -mm. No. I gotta get. I gotta. Get, I don't know what's wrong with it. You saw. You saw how terrible it runs. Bro. It yeah. could barely make it there back. And hey, remember, that's remember that's how we were going to school? That truck has given you many years of service. Yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> oh, well, I wanted to, I wanted to right. live longer than me. I see that. <laughs> oh, wow. When someone's up to you, up to it, some of these tomato plants need to be transplanted. We just did some. Oh, okay. Today. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah, there's like a, there's a bunch of mature. Yes. Yeah. Oh, so yeah. yeah, we'll good. Okay. Yeah. I'm hoping we can get more tomatoes than we can eat. You want more to? I mean, I'm telling you, you're gonna have a bunch of tomatoes. Yeah. Well, I can eat a big jam bowl every day. Tomatoes are expensive in the store. Huh? I said it's good because tomato is expensive in the store. Yeah, and then the tomatoes you grow here, you you can't hardly buy those. Uh -uh. No. You know what I mean? It's no, like from them, no, if you do, they're like over five dollars a pound. Yeah, here they here they are. Expensive. In, uh, yeah, modest. these heirloom tomatoes. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> yeah. Oh, so <laughs> the other thing I need help with is um, I put that post in. Um, I want to back my truck up and then put a 2x4 on top of the two posts. So, <clears throat> I don't know. Uh, Are you talking in things? No. No, that, that were for the rose, for the rose trellis. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I need to, that, once I have the one post on between the two, uh -huh. then, uh, then I, you know, it's all, it's all in place. And then I just want to run, run, string. To uh, and contain that whole rose bush and that lavender bush. Uh -huh. Yeah. Or is that lavender? Or, I don't know. It's what a that rose is. bush. Force. No, the one next to it. Oh, lilac. 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 Is it lilac? I don't know. Lilac. It's one of those purple ones. Yeah. Yeah. I think it's a lilac, isn't it? Or is it mm -hmm. I think those two bushes will be happier tied and contained. Or at least will be happier because they're just spreading all over the place. Have you walked around and seen all the fruit that's coming? Yes, I I showed I showed Melissa the the almonds. I, I just keep looking at the blackberry. Bless all the others. Yeah. But I'm looking at the, at the uh, mulberry. Mulberry. Yeah. I bless all the others. I said bless yeah. all the others, but then look at that mulberry. Mulberry. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I wish I knew if that thing needed fertilizer or what. But mulberry. I don't know. I just. That Marlboro don't need nothing. I know, it seems happy. Yeah. It's, I just wanted to stay you happy. Imagine you don't yeah. want to go mess with nothing. I know. <laughs> I just wanted to stay happy. because want to do his job on it the way it is. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you see all the cool. berries on nothing. it? All it's of it cool, is full. Cool. Yeah, I'll water it. Soup start ripening around late June. Uh, uh, mid, mid, so I've gotten... We came, I've, here, we came here in... July. In July, mm -hmm. there was lots of berries. Yeah, yeah we came here like in yeah, I think, July. I think, yeah, usually I get the first berries right around the middle of June, yeah, no. but sometimes 20, it changes. 20 July, almost right. the end of July. Came. Yeah, but, See, but, you, but it was a lot already. It was picked. so much. Yeah. Yeah. It was a lot already picked. You were saying, and it, like we had to reach further up. Yeah, like the lower. It changes thing. sometimes. It, it, the earliest I've ever gotten them is middle of June, June fifteenth, but. Mm -hmm. um Sometimes they don't give it to like Fourth of July, mm. but then when you give it on Fourth of July, you then it goes later. Start ripening. Yeah, it seems like I get three months, mm. like uh, middle of June, middle of July, middle of August, no, oh, four months. Middle of June, middle of July, wait, middle of July, middle of August, yeah, three months. Yeah, 
-hmm. Yeah, so if it starts in the middle of July, it'll go to the middle of September, but then I've also had it start in the end of Ju uh, June. Mm -hmm. No, I, middle of June, I mean it oh, starts. Mm -hmm. If it starts in the end of June, it goes to the end of September. Okay, yeah. got you. So, got you. It's, it's so like you're gonna you get, get it's still the full months. You still get three full months, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the more you pick, the more the beer, yeah. That's what it seems like to me. Huh? Yeah. yeah. Yep. Makes sense, right? No. no. The tree likes having people in it. Yep. It's magic tree. Want to give? Yeah. Okay. What was that? Oh. <laughs> what? So tell me about Veronica. I've known about this my whole life, but I didn't. Like, she never talks to me. You know, I wasn't even sure it was a woman. It's, it's a woman on one side and something else on the other side. What? Okay. What? That's the red chicken over there. What are they in the in the greenhouse? No, they're in the. To me, where the, this one down here. Uh. She has the thing closed and they keep harassing her today. <laughs> okay. Uh. You know, people like to have the, the spirit they work with and they don't want to hear nothing negative about it because in itself it's negative. Yeah. But this thing... Well, I told you it wants to kill me. <laughs> the other side of that same one. Oh, it's the, the same one? It's the same one. Yeah. understand why I decide to dedicate my life to this stuff yeah. I have. I just don't tell people about it. Yeah. I ask you not to share it because I'm not ready to tell a bunch of people. If people meet me and pick up, pick it up, yeah. then I'll confess it. Yeah. Okay. When I was a child, I grew up in Jamaica. Okay? Yeah. I grew up around this crap. Everybody want to use some spirits to do something. And most people used to do evil. So you um, have so you have people using these spirits to do voodoo. Yeah. And I mean, I'm talking about, I grew up seeing people get see, really sick. Yeah. And no doctors can cure them. Even people send them away to for nothing. Doctors can't even find out what happened to people. I remember when I was a child, I used to be like, oh my gosh. You know? And I remember my mom used to say to me, don't worry about it. Never worry about it. Yes, there's these spirits, but there's a bigger one. There's the biggest, there's the great spirit. There's the greatest spirit and the one who created us. That one is the powerful one. You pay attention to that one. Ignore the others. If you pay attention to the, to the greatest spirit, the others can't hurt you. And let me tell you something. When I was a child, I can't tell you how much how much times I've, these things try to kill me. Oh yeah. I'm talking about, but you can't tell everybody this because a lot of people in America, especially, don't believe in. They just wake up and go. They don't around. believe what? They don't believe in spirits. I'm oh. not talking Indians. Indians do. Yeah, yeah. That's what I love about Indians. Yeah. You understand? Because they got the know. They understand spiritual stuff. Yeah, yeah. You know, they're not. You know, the Americans come. To an Indian, something I watch Indians do the dance and think, Oh, I don't know what the hell is these people. They don't understand. Yeah, there's stuff behind it. They don't it. understand there's stuff behind it. Yeah. You understand? So I know that there's stuff behind it. And so, um, <sighs> and uh, so that I know that the cultures of India, Africa, the West Indies, um, all foreign country, most foreign countries. Yeah. I have this thing strong and I understand it. Yeah. I was married to a guy who was clueless. Oh, really? Clueless. Yes, his <laughs> second wife was full of shit. His second wife? Yes. What, what wife were you? I'm first. Oh, you're the first wife? The first. Was that um, your first husband or your second husband? My, my first. I'm, I'm never married. Again. Oh, okay. but I, I'm married, but whatever. <laughs> the, 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 the husband don't know it yet, but whatever. <laughs> He'll find out pretty soon. <laughs> anyway, um, but I married the father first. You know, because 
I see that there's a lot of people who need help, who got stuff going on that don't understand it. Anyway, the this this intensity, this intense environment I grew up. I'm not talking about light stuff. I'm talking about intense stuff. I'm talking about life and death. Yeah. I'm talking about one moment somebody's talking to you, the normal, their teacher, a doctor or something, and pissed off somebody and that person say, you wait and see what I'm going to do to you. Ah. You wait and see what I'm going to do to you. Yeah. Right? Well, who does you? That, uh, in, in Jamaican, they say, you wait and see what I'm going to do to you. It means, you wait and see what I will do to you. Oh, I, okay. And that's wait, say it I again slower. See. You wait and see what I'm going to do to you. Say it louder. You wait and see what I'm going to do to you. Oh. So that's the, you know. Okay, yeah, I get it. It's mm -hmm. just, you yes. kind of like. You kind of twist it. Yeah, yeah. Some of the words. Right, right, right. Yeah. And uh, it, uh, you'd see these people. And they would laugh it off. They, yeah. they, these people would laugh it off. Yeah. And then you'll see. I remember my teacher. His name is Teacher Kelly. I remember when we was in teaching one day and the guy just get up and start walking around the table laugh, laughing and laughing and, and tell all of us to sit on the bench and push us all off. Yeah. Like the line us all up on the, on the bench and just push us all off. You understand? He went nuts in a, like that fast. Yeah, yeah. So those things, I see these things. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. And I start understanding that this is this spirit controlled by mind. The control by mind. They control our mind. They can take they take over your mind, yeah. let your mind take over your body, or they they can attack your body with some kind of illness. Yeah, yeah. You know. And I just saw two people with power. Yeah. I saw voodoo people with power. I saw church people jumping around down, praying like they have power. Yeah. And not a dang thing happened. So I know there was something off with that. Yeah. I saw that, okay, how come they had the power and then they say they serve. They, the voodoo people, who I know can be serving the, the, um, the creator that my mom taught me about, yeah. have all this power. Yeah. And how come these people who supposedly are church people who are supposed to be serving the creator that have all the power, but they don't. They're not showing no power. Yeah. So I start questioning that from a child. Yeah. So how do I get protected? If they can't save me and they can, and they can kill me, yeah. who do I go to? So it came to me. I better get a real personal with the one who created me. Yeah. To get protected from all these crazy people. Yeah. You know? Yeah. <clears throat> and I remember one time as a like I was nine eight or so. Uh -huh. This thing showed up in my room, in my house, yeah, in yeah. my house. My mom could not see anything. I always, I as a child, saw sp these things yeah. all the time. I saw them like I could speak to you. You see when that movie came out, say, did you ever see that movie where I see dead people? Oh, no. You, you never saw that movie? That's not the name of the movie. There's another what? one. If that's not the name of the movie. What's it's, the name? It's called... Um, with that little boy. Yeah, there. yeah, with Bruce Willis. Is it Bruce Willis? Yeah, yeah. yeah. The, right. Yeah, no, it's know? called... Um, because of, but I know what yeah, movie you're talking about. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When that movie came out, yeah. I start cracking up. Yeah, yeah. Because I'm like, that little boy is me. Right, yeah. He says yeah. that. He says yes, that. I see dead people. But that's not the name of the movie. There you go. I, I it's with Bruce it. Willis, I call, though. I call it, I see dead yeah, people. Yeah. I remember the name of the movie. That's, Something about... That uh, took me right back to my childhood. I mean, to me... Because I could see so many activities going on. Yeah. It was just going on all around me. I could see another room, but I, as a child, I thought it was my grandmother could see it too. And, um, uh, um, and, and my mom looked as blind as a bat. Yeah. You, you, you understand what I'm saying? Totally blind. Mm -hmm. The only thing my mom knew was. I bet it was your grandmother that came from her. Uh, my grandmother. Yeah, see that it skipped yes, a lot. Yes, uh -huh. uh, and she, I'm so thankful she was around because I remember when I would see them, I was like, hey, what are you doing that for? That, and my grandmother would come and get me. Right. That type of stuff. And my mom was like, what is going on? But after my mom, my grandmother died, my mom, you know that you can, you can help block a child gift. My mom. You can block a what? Help, help block a child gift because that was a gift. That was a gift. Oh, I block had a to child's gift. gift. Yes. Okay. Yeah. She starts saying to me, you imagining stuff. 
stop imagining stuff. Uh, that type yeah, of stuff. Yeah, you yeah, understand? Yeah. Right. So because I got to start getting scared, I never want to see anything anymore. Yeah. And prayed for help and all that type of stuff. So it got subverted. It got it got underneath. But but as an adult, I could sense stuff. When I started, when I got came to America and all this, I could sense stuff. Like for example, I just knew stuff like. Before I came to America, I, I had a sense that I was going to leave the country. And it takes like a year or so to get my pass, to get a passport. It don't matter what you do, it take a year or more. And you just came to me, I need to get it now because when you get the passport, you're going to go fast. That type of stuff. I just knew things like that. Yeah. And then, but when I came up here, I totally didn't get in the spirit side realm. So I was on a physical life, you know. But then he... Something happened to me in 2005. In 2005, I took a, I took a trip. Me and my mom took Oh, a trip. 2005. 2005. Okay. Yes, I took I a trip. I was trying to understand what you were saying. Sorry. In 2005, I took a trip. And on that trip, something changed. I... Actually, right before the trip, I started praying more. I started thinking, you know... I don't think I like this life I'm living. This I don't feel like this is the life I'm supposed to be living. This is not me. There's more to this. It's so superficial. I know more. You know, it's yeah. like I pretend like before I was pretending like I, there was nothing else. You know, there was nothing else than what I'm seeing in the natural. Yeah. You know, and that's I chose to just see what I see in the natural, and then I came to a what do you call it? A, Crossroads. Yeah. Where, yeah, where, where I just felt, I, I just want to live a deeper meaning. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. And, um, and that's why I just started praying and questioning and praying and questioning and remembering growing up and remembering, um, like even things, and I, because I work in the jail system, I knew, I, I knew. I could. I knew every demon that walked through that door. Oh, yeah. I knew them. What? I knew them. <laughs> oh, that place was full of demons. <laughs> you know what? Was telling you this. Uh, Jesus lives in prison because um, everyone who goes to prison finds him. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm going to say that. But I'm, I'm going to share something with you. I'm going to share something with you. Right? I'm going to share something with you because. It's interesting that you used, you say, Jesus, because yeah. <laughs> you notice that we never, you never hear us say, I don't know you know, ever notice that we never, we have never said that name to you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because the Hebrew name we use is Yahushua. Yeah, yeah. Because I've learned that the name Jesus is yeah. from the name Zeus. Yeah, yeah. Which is the demon of another level of stuff. That's the Greek that's a king of the Greek gods. Right. Yeah. And that that demon that that demon is actually from all the demons come from the one main place but the for the world the head of the world demons is the Egyptian gods. But the, all the Egyptian gods at every new era they change call it right. Every every new who would be Zeus right now? Zeus. <laughs> Zeus is Jesus. Ah. Uh, you see? Right, Cover right. up. But, well, so but many. That's, but, but we know. But, but though. But let me say this though. But people are serving. Trying to serve Yahushua. Yeah. But being led to serve. Zeus. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> I was included in that because I didn't know. I went to church like everybody else yeah. under that system, yeah. not understanding. Yeah. But if you say that to the average Christian, they will oh, yeah, they kill you. Out, yeah. They say what you say. Oh, you're a demon. You follow, right. they you say, follow Satan. Right. Yeah. That's right. Right. Yeah. Right. So, but and then, but and then, if too, if you say that the and I'm saying his true name, Yahushua, yeah. had children. That's even more. I know that he did come. His name was Yahushua, not Jesus. Yeah. He had children. Oh yeah. 
don't tell no Christian no. that. Oh, yeah. That's not believable to them. Yeah. And that we are these, these descendants of children. Right, right. Exactly oh, so here's look, check this out. This is a theory that I came up with. I believe that aliens came to this to this planet mm -hmm. and interbred with the with the people who are here, and that's the Republicans. <laughs> well, <laughs> because they want to extract, they want to take everything. They want to use all the oil. They want to. Exactly. They, they're messing with the food, yes. Monsanto. Yes. They're they're uh, they're all they're making it so that they can control all the right, people. Right. Those are the aliens. Okay. Well, you know what? Uh, this is what I see. I'm not disagreeing with you, but this is why I know that there's in my mind those people are demons. Yeah. That will never change. They don't have no idea, understanding to change. Yeah. Like my, well, they don't know that's they what they know. are. They don't exactly. Know. Yeah. So if you talk to them and try to get them to change, they look at you like, are you? It's like you're talking on two different planets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you can't have no understanding. Yeah. None of your conversation will be like, yeah, I understand what you're saying. Yeah, but you. They don't get it. They don't get it. Yeah. That's because they're from some other place. Yeah, they're from another place. When there's this they're thing called the uh, invader mentality, when yeah. if you like, like say, say. You lived uh, in North America, or no, you may, lived in Europe. Mm -hmm. Well, you would go, people would go on a ship to, to Americas, and they want to take everything, take everything they can, right? right? They want to they they grab all the yeah. riches yeah. Yeah. and bring yeah. it back. And yeah. so sometimes yeah. it takes generations. Exactly. Like their children yeah. will feel the same way, <laughs> yes. Yes. and they don't even know that's what right. they're doing. Right. That's just right. in them. They tend to do that. Right, that's right. That's their purpose. Right, right. That's their purpose. They can't stop, they can't help themselves from doing it right. purpose. Right, because it's they don't even know them. that's what they are. Right. It's like a machine yeah. to go out and right. like, set, like, okay, Extract. go do that. Right. Extract the riches. Exactly. That's what it is. Yeah. But it's the same thing with the spirit. Like you can send a spirit to go do something. Yeah. That spirit, go. Right. Be if you have authority over that spirit, that spirit, go. And go do that thing. That's why they want to get all the oil. They want to use all, every last drop of oil. You know what I mean? They, and, and, and if they don't get stuff, they will. Oh, well, they're if, trying. If they're they trying. don't get stuff, they'll just blow the whole thing up. They'll yep. just finish this thing off. But they're not. They're going to get stuff. It's a point. Well, it's a point. It's, it's a point to stop. Well, when and it gets to a certain point when it's all gone, then they're going to have to stop because they won't have no more. Well, it's gonna be, they're going to be stopped shorter than people think. Yeah. They're not going to get to do a bunch of stuff. But anyway, um, the whole thing is, that that's where I started getting this thing like I got to, it's, I'm not going to let the demon control me because that's no what controls and I know I want father, I want the one who create me to protect me and tell me how. Yeah, yeah. How, how, how. So I started praying to him and that's what started, that's how my journey started. Because I remember where I came from, all the stuff that happened as I, as I was growing up. Yeah. And that's how I started because I'm like, I know, and I remember I'm like, and I asked him the question, what is this thing? Because I'm like, okay, with the church stuff, I'm like, why are the church so broken up? Why, yeah. why are they, they're so powerless? Yeah. How come they don't show you power? Yeah. I said, you create all this stuff. Yeah. And these people say they serve you. Oh. Okay, and I want to serve you, but I don't want to go. How, 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 where is the power? Why are they so powerless? Why they can't heal nobody? For real heal. Yeah. Why can't they castle demons for real? Yeah. Why can't they do this? Tell me. And he told me. He told me. He told me. I'm so thankful he couldn't tell me everything at once. He said, just study. Stay to yourself. Don't go to their church. Yeah. Because you... He said, just listen, you stay, and so, and that's where I praise. Because he promised that, and, and, and believe me, I believe in the Bible, but that's when he also told me that the Bible was translated, a lot of the words oh, yeah. were translated to please King, what, whoever. Oh, yeah, King James, yeah. Yes, and the name Lord was taken because that's what they call all the English people. Yeah. All the kings and the lords and all this, that's all that meant. Yeah. And so, when he showed me all that, over time, and it shocked. It was shocking to me. Yeah. It was shocking, but you know what? I know it was the truth. And I and he said, and he helped me. He said, the Bible. I did 
inspire it. Yeah. That will show you what is true and what. what yeah, is yeah, that's. Saying. I agree and completely. So that's, so that's how the, my journey started. There's no, there's no direct manuscripts for the mm -hmm. Bible. Mm -hmm. It's all copies of copies. But the thing is, there is some truths in it. Yeah, of yeah, course. Of yeah. course. I mean, it's I, I, based on yes, truth. Yes, But it, like, like you said, um, it was translated to please King James. Exactly. Yep. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And and different people to suit their whatever, you know. And so he, so uh, it, somebody like said to me, oh, what, what, whatever you need to do, everything is never. I'm like, if Father yeah. said, on a prayer, he's like, if anybody think. All of me is in that little book. Yeah, yeah. That's a, that's a very oh yeah, it's very uh, limiting. Simple, simple minded. It's right. Small and the thing is, you can you can, you can take it. little pieces of it and make make it say say whatever you want if you put your right spin on it. Like people well, that, have used that, it to that, kill that people, exactly. stone people. Exactly. You know, it's like exactly. it also says that uh, if yeah. something if you're not a virgin, you're supposed to be killed. Right. Or, you know exactly. what I mean? There you go. Right. Exactly. That's not right. No. No, right. At this point, go out there and go stone. That's why uh, when uh, um, Yahushua had to show the stupidness of that, he's like, okay, well, if you have never done a sin and you think that is a sin, then go and stone that woman then. Yeah. And see, if you never did anything wrong, right. and you think that woman sinned because she's not a virgin, then go stone her. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They couldn't even lift a, 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 a they couldn't even lift a finger. Right. Because they know they all they saw how stupid that was. Right. You know, it's like, oh my gosh, just take something and twist it and and for the most understanding and most of the things extremely spiritual. It's a spiritual book. Yeah. It's a spiritual book that can only be understood on a spiritual level. Okay, right, so take, it, so take a break. When you just as a side note, when yeah. you get a chance because, you know what, I have a hard time understanding the Bible or deciphering it. I want you to... Acts 2? Acts 2, yeah. Uh, I want you I to... Read, no. I, I did, want you I to uh, you know, give me your analysis of Acts 2. <laughs> because someone sent it to me. <laughs> and uh, and there's a there's a part that... Uh, that uh, mm -hmm. I, wanna, I want the begin I want the stuff before it and the mm -hmm. stuff after it mm -hmm. to be explained. Because... Um, because they say, what does it mean? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I want to, I want to find out what they were doing, what they were mm -hmm. talking about. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. I'm just curious what that, what mm -hmm. that says. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> just okay. give me your spin on it, your take on it. Okay. What, what do you think it means? Okay. Yeah. I mean, you know, here's the thing. Uh, I don't, I don't. Uh, I, uh, when I spoke at a college. The first thing I say is if I if don't believe anything I say. If I say something and you think it mean it rings true, investigate it for yourself. yourself. You yep. know what I mean? Ask exactly. ask spirit. The it's other thing I said yep. is ask Google because mm -hmm. Google is like it's like humanity's brain. Mm -hmm. And and Google has Google has a lot of information if you know how to ask the right way. Mm -hmm. So that when I spoke at a college that's what I said. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I told one of my friends uh, that I said the first. The first thing I said was, hey, "Don't believe anything I say." She's like, if "Someone said that, I'd probably listen to him." <laughs> well, you know, it's 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 like this. Uh, well, we started talking about this because of this spirit that I see. Yeah. There. Well, I, I'm trying to see spirit, and I don't say it to people because <clears throat> a lot of people are shocked. Yeah. They don't know it's there. Oh, I know it's there. Uh, some people know it's there. Yeah. And they know why and they know what it's doing. Yeah. Some people don't know the full of what it's doing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, some people very well know the full of what it's doing and don't care. Yeah, yeah. I've seen women leave here <sighs> like their hair was on fire. You know what I mean? They get here and they just feel it and they run. They run out of here. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? It's like, and then okay, I've seen it. Let, I've let seen me people. Tell you, this this spirit, she's a bitch. Yeah, I can see. She, she is a she's bitch. jealous too, she's right? She's a bitch, and 